Hello everyone and welcome back to another really festive episode of For Honor. I mean, it's the only really festive episode of For Honor you're gonna get from me, but... But, hello, nonetheless, and uh, welcome back to the round table. Long time no see, I finally finished my session, I can finally play For Honor, and I can finally accomplish what I wanted to accomplish on a real, for a really long time, on camera, and it is to wrap my Nabushi up to Reputation 40. Oh god, it's been so long that I wanted to do this. It's, it's been like maybe two months that this was on my screen and you have no idea how hard it was for me not to reach 40. In fact, the fact that uh, there was a test, like the public test uh, for the servers, for the dedicated servers, uh, helped me out a lot because I was actually able to rep 40 mind the bush and be like, yes. I feel good. I can wait a little bit longer because technically I already did it. But in reality, I did not, and that made me feel really good, and made me actually be able to wait till uh, this particular video. So yes, here is my Nabushi, my rep, about to be rep 40 Nabushi. Uh, she's pretty, really different from what you've seen uh, in my recent uh, For Honor videos, and the reason for that is because, first of all, a long ass time has passed since those videos, and second of all, well, I kind of want to do something different for once, because Manabushi was always... I I'm not joking here. I tried some colors out sometimes, but, like, the only color that actually always stayed... Ah, fuck, which one was it? Oh god, this looks fucking terrible. Ugh, why is my higher rep legendary ass gear looks like crap with white? It's like if... Ugh. It's like someone painted it badly. Ugh. Even the hat. I mean, the hat actually looks okay, it looks like there's actual snow on it, but like the rest, ugh! I never even looked at this before, so I'm, uh... Okay, I'm done. <laughs> fuck, which one was it? God, I don't even remember anymore. God damn, Arthur, what the fuck is wrong with you, mate? I'm actually gonna go one by one, because I really wanna know. Oh god, I'm wasting so much storage space on this, I could be fighting right now. I could be loading for a match, because For Honor is so neat now, and you can... Fucking look at your shit. Well, Red Dusk. There you go. That's the one. That's the one that I've been using for the longest time. And honestly, it's still one of the best fucking color compositions for Nabushi because it goes well with pretty much everything. And her high level gear actually doesn't let you like customize her colors that much, which is kind of disappointing to a certain level. Wait, did I just change it? <laughs> did I just change it by accident? Wait, why, why am I in this? Did I actually click at, certain, at a certain point? Well, shit. Now I need to find the one that I was at before. God damn it. God damn it. Which one was it? No, I have no clue which one was it before. Oh, there it was. Okay. I also wasn't using this particular uh, sh paint pattern. There you go. That's how it's called. I remember. But yeah, that's the one. I also bought the festive fucking emote for her. Like the mask. Not the snowball fight. Because that's fucking expensive and it's absurd. Actually, yes, I did buy it for her. What am I saying? <laughs> I'm a liar. I absolutely bought it. Where? Wait, 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 wait. There you go. I absolutely bought it. Alright, so I wanted to the first uh, go into a duel and make sure it's gonna be fun and all, but I'm way too rusty with the bushy. And if I go into a duel for my first match of the day, I'm gonna probably get my ass kicked like immediately. Or, or I'm gonna win, I'm gonna be happy. But I want to have one match only, which will result into me getting that wrap up. And I believe that in Dominion, at this moment, I will find a good group that will support me throughout anything that happens, throughout any shaman that is in the opposite team. Also, I have no idea how to counter shaman with Nabushi. I just realized that. Because for the past two months, I've been, tr I've been maining Kensei, and a little bit of Warden, and a little bit of fucking everyone, particularly Berserker, because I fucking love Berserker. Uh, but he's absurd. But, uh, oh no, it's the Kensei. Louis Abu is a Kensei, I know that for sure. Oh no, this is not a good team to be in. And I believe that in Dominion, at this moment, I will find a good group that will support me throughout anything that happens. Oh, it's probably a match in progress already, isn't it? Oh god. Oh god, oh no. Oh no. Oh no, this is not gonna go as well as I freaking will, isn't it? 
I mean, a good Orochi will Orochi the shit out of anyone. Oh, no, they have two PKs. Okay, I'm taking it back. My skill is lower than my enemies? What? How dare you, game? That's a first. I've actually never had it before. Well, let's go to C, where people just died and are dying. Okay, I don't want to go to C anymore, but oh well. Oh well. Ow, 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 ow. Woo. Come on, kill the Kensei. Do it. Ooh, that was a one hit fucking. Oh, and he was debuffed? Wait, does, re does revenge actually, like, uh, negate all of the. Um, why would you do that? As an opener. What's wrong with you? <laughs> oh man, I actually took back two points. That's good. Whew. That was a good one. I'm, I'm surprised. That PK could have spam zoned a little bit more. In my opinion. Could have done better. But didn't. It's okay. You lost zone A. Ah, he knows. Shit! Shit! I stance! I stance instead! Ah, oh, shit! You did gotta be good! Ooh! Fuck. The thing is, is that Kensei's block, like, dodge on block... Wait, no, wait, incorrect. Dodge while blocking is an incredibly powerful tool, and it's basically like... The Aramusha stan uh, full block stance before the Aramusha full block stance. It's exactly what it does, and it's incredibly powerful. And I didn't want to get into the fact that Aramusha is absurdly strong against Nabushi. And I don't know how people are still not fucking getting it in ganks, but that's okay. And this is why dedicated servers are absolutely a fucking marvel. I just want to point out that this is an easy anti-cheat error, so uh, absolutely not related to the connection as far as I know. So, I, I mean, me freaking out about how good the dedicated servers are is still pretty neat, but uh, really not related to what's happening. I'm not gonna deny the fact that, yes, there are still people who are lag switching. Yes, there are people who are fucking lagging as a motherfucker, and probably that's because of the absence of servers in their pla uh, specific placement of habitat. I don't know what the fuck that I just said. Uh, but, this shit doesn't fucking happen. I played about like 20, 25 matches on the dedicated servers beta, and this shit did not happen. And that was fucking amazing. There was no interruptions uh, during the match. There was no interruptions to break the match. Oh god, I'm mad. Ooh. Oh man. Merry Christmas, y'all. Happy holidays or whatever. And I just picked my mic. Oh, I better not have. Because I will sound terrible. Oh boy. Oh, I'm mad. Oh, I'm so mad, ladies and gentlemen. No, not Tribute. Fuck Tribute. Nabushi's not that good in Tribute, unless you have a Shaman by your side, but... I mean, everything is easier with a Shaman by your side. Unless it's two Shamans. Or three Shamans. Or four. Like... The, you or have a perfect amount of Shamans on your team, or you have too many Shamans on your team, or you have not enough Shamans on your team. Because if, if you have one Shaman, usually you will win, mostly because it's a good support and an attack character and a neutralizer. She's a good everything. But if you have two shamans, they usually will cancel each other out by just shoving the fucking opponent out of the other one. Oh, okay. I guess I'm joining the same fucking place. 
Uh, are they in a fucking four stack? Uh, also, how did he do the fucking emblem thing when there's nothing around? It's so cool. I want to do that. I want to do that. I don't know how to do that. Uh, everyone is leaving. Motherfucker. Man, I'm mad. Wow, what a surprise. Not enough players. Dang. Feck. What's also really interesting is that uh, when it comes to Aramusha, who I actually made for a little bit of time, like, he... He's an incredibly fun character to play. Like, don't take me wrong, he is a better Berserker in some way. I know, like, a lot of people say, Oh, Shaman is the rework Berserker deserves or whatever. Fuck no! There was, like, maybe two things that, like, Shaman and Berserker have alike, but at the same time, that's the case with literally every single character, even the Bushi. She has, like, her own hidden stats. Like, her back dodge into charge or back dodge into, like, char like pounce heavy are pretty much like have the same dodge properties as Nabushi's uh, hidden stats in some way but even better because sometimes if you dodge the correct timing the opponent will be actually out of uh, range for his own guard break and that is absurdly good like it's insane how good that is also I really like the fact that you can now dodge out of traps but I have to say I kind of want to dodge out of a catapult as well. <laughs> or at least, you know, like, reduce the size of the catapult, because it can one-shot someone. Not not a lot of feats can one-shot someone. At full health, that is. It's, it's absurd how good it is, and people still neglect the fact that... Oh, well, no, people actually know perfectly that it's not okay, but they, they still use it because it's there. It's like an exploit without being an exploit because it's totally a thing in the game. Yeah, I mean, come on. It's just a cheap thing. It's a ch it's cheese. It's like Peacekeeper. It's like Gladiator Zone. It's like Gladiator Stow Stab on Shugoki after he hit one light. It's like exactly that. <laughs> oh, boy. Which, by the way, if I'm not mistaken, Shugoki cannot dodge the Toe Stab, like, at all. Like, no matter how hard I try, it never fucking happens. It's, <laughs> it's absurd. And yes, I do play Shugoki. It's incredibly fun to kill with the Demons of Race. Like, you have no idea what it is if you never play Shigoki. But if you do, you know what I'm saying, you know what I'm saying. Oh man, it's hot in here. It's actually not. I reduced the um, heat so much that I feel like it's a little bit uh, too cold. Okay, you know what? I'm uh, gonna do something really quick. I just realized why I'm getting a little bit of lag on my screen, not actually on your recording that you're seeing. Shit. I mean, the thing is that Kensei is such a um, kind of dangerous character to play that you kind of need to go for parries. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Oh! Whoops, whoops! I did not mean to press it. Whoops! <laughs> come here, little fat ass ninja. What's he talking about? <laughs> oh man. Hey, not bad. Not bad. Oh man, I, I, uh, yesterday I was playing as a Ramusha uh, in a Dominion match and I really wish I was recording that shit because spamming his zone against someone who cannot parry his zone during revenge like constantly is a fucking just, it's a beauty in its own. It's like a whole different feeling and I kind of understood how PKs feel at that moment because that's what PKs do. They spam fast attacks and their fast attacks are absolutely fast attacks so that's why I kind of... Oof, I kind of felt bad, but at the same time, I felt amazing, because... Ah, it was. Also, after the update, the Season 4 update, they did a really weird thing with Nabushi, where... If she... If she actually, like, does a light attack, actually brings her further away from the opponent, 
Which is a really weird thing, but at the same time, it actually makes sense. Oh boy. Oh, they all left. How nice of them. Fuck, I cannot parry him for some reason. One. Come on. I got revenge just in that second. Oh, man. Oh, that was fun. Oh, boy. I go completely silent now, don't I, when I play uh, Nobushi. Holy shit. Because I concentrate so badly because Centurion is such a fucking shitty opponent to play on P2P. And actually, fuck your own dedicated service. I'm not going to lie. Like, they're just a piece of shit. And not because, like, the players are a garbage person or because they can get you in a cutscene. None of that, like, that's absolutely normal. It's it's okay, it's for honor, we're used to that shit. The big problem... <laughs> is a simpler one. His charged heavies have such, so many variations that, like, the parry timings are absolutely garbage. Hey, baby. Ah, Ramusha, what are you doing? Don't attack me. Ramusha is one of the best fucking team killers. <laughs> Honestly, like. Up. Up. He's a, he's a zoning. He's a. Um... There you go. He turned to me. Oh man, that, that mask is cool. I like it. I honestly wish, like, it would actually breathe ice or something. That would be much cooler, but it's okay. Oh man, actual like teamed executions would be fucking awesome. Hello. Oh, where are you running? I was kind of hoping that someone's gonna close the gate on him. That'd be amazing. Ooh, Musha! What are you doing? Oh, wow, you nasty son of a bitch. Oh man, I can't I can't wait on being rep 40. Also. Like, I played, I played Kansei a lot, and, uh, I am not gonna lie. Whoa, that was a light. Buried. Heavied. Still trying to go, eh? Nope. Nice. You can, you can do that as much as you want, man. Ah, fucking skulls! Goddamn skulls on the, in the, like everywhere on the screen! Oh man, so annoying! Ooh, my voice is slightly shaking because I'm so fucking pumped up. I'm slightly shaking myself. God, I love Mabushi. Fuck, I miss this so much. Ooh, oh man. Of course, I have a shitload of gear in the inventory. Oh man. Repetition 40, Dreamscape! Woo hoo! Oh man. Oh man, fuck this one. Looks like shit. This one's cool. Oh, this one's really cool. I like this one. Oh, hi there. Phone, shut up! <laughs> oh my god. We did it, ladies and gentlemen. 
Rap 40 Nabushi, baby. How did people like get into the... There you go. That's the screen. Woo! Oh man, finally! Haha! <laughs> oh, only took quite literally a year to do it. Like, I, w I would say a lot less considering like... Uh, I had to, you know, wait until my session stops so I can actually record properly. But here it is, ladies and gentlemen. I'm a Reputation 40 in Abushi now. And one of the things that I kept saying to everyone that I played, like, for the past two months against, uh, like, both in Dominion, both in anything, is that I'm retired as an Abushi, and I absolutely agree with that because... There's no- there's nothing more to earn with her besides even more experience and even more mix-ups because... I've seen some people do some mad-ass mix-ups with the Hidden Stance recently, and I've, I've been seriously impressed. Because it's actually really, really cool. Like, it's- they kind of use it as the unblockable, uh, the Raiders unblockable. Because they go into the stance, they do a heavy, and they faint it, and they just wait for you to- uh, for you to parry. And, uh, me as a parry happy motherfucker out of stamina, uh, when I'm facing an Ibushi, I usually consider them, uh, lower skilled than me, and I usually consider, uh, consider that they won't do the same things that I do, or they'll do much less things that I do, like, in a lower quality, what I mean is that they won't be as good as me, uh, and I usually get wrecked if I think that, but at the same time, the Nabushis who actually do those mix-ups are all ne Reputation 40 Nabushis. The Nabushis who actually relock during a gang fight so that uh, their zone is unblockable, their sidewinder is, un I mean, unparable, unparable to the to another enemy that they were just locked on, are usually the Nabushis who are rep 40. There's no, I've never seen a Nabushi that is rep 7 that was using that proper tech correctly or at all. So, yeah. By the way, this is not a bad color. It's trippy as shit. I love it. Hell yeah, baby. Ooh, all of the fucking out. Oh wow, that's a cool outfit. Look at this one. Damn, I'm sure it's looking bad with blue. But I still like the fact that my mask has nothing on it. It's just like, I just realized it's like a white face. I'll just cut this part out. All right, all right. Cut it out for the smile. It's it's all for the smile. Okay, it's definitely not for the color. God damn it, it's fucking fuck. <laughs> oh man. You can definitely be sure that I'm gonna play Nabushi more on this channel. So if you're here for Nabushi plays and that kind of stuff, whoa, that's that's a good one. Okay. If you're if you're here for the Nabushi plays, you can be sure that I'm gonna play her because her moveset is such a I don't know, not large in the sense of why is there still so much stuff? Uh, all the fucking outfits. Anyway, her moveset has so many different quirks to it. Like, there's so many... Uh, because it's cons a considerably large moveset for, like, the most of the original cast. In fact, I think it might be the longest. Correct me on that if I'm wrong. But uh, that moveset is incredibly, incredibly good and interesting to test against, like, different moves. Like, if you saw my Ramusha versus uh, Nabushi duels, uh, side of the winder when timed correctly, can actually dodge Aramusha's zone and hit him. It's ridiculously satisfying to watch and execute, but it's just insanely fucking interesting that th there's moves that Mbushi has that can dodge but at the same time attack, but that don they don't look like they dodge that much, but they're a dodge movement by default, but they don't dodge everything, so now there's a question of what they actually dodge and what they don't. In any case, thank you everyone so much for watching. Look at this beauty. Oh man, this Naginata fucking looks sick. Like the fucking blade. Oh, the rainbow blade is awesome. I think it's one of the more recent ones. This one's cool. This one reminds me of uh, some guards that uh, Aramusha and Kansi have. Uh, oh, that's, that looks kind of lame. Also looks like Canada already exists. I know that they reused some assets for it. Like I've seen the threads on Reddit and... I mean, what do you want? When like R Roman or someone like came into the office and were like, Hey guys, we need new weapons for the event. But the event is like in, a f in like three weeks. How are we supposed to do this, man? Are we s you really want us to model like all new fucking weaponry? Come on. <laughs> I'm sure they had to make do what they have to make do with. In any case, enough.
I've been uh, talking a lot in this video, and this video is ridiculously long. I might actually cut it in two, which would be dumb. In any case, thank you everyone so much for watching. Thank you in particular. Thank you for sticking around at the round table. Thank you for considering subscribing and considering liking this video or disliking it even then. And tell me down in the comments below what I could do better and what I could do worse. <laughs> thank you once again really much. I, from all of my heart, I wish you a really Merry Christmas, even though it's past that, way past that. And a really happy holidays, even though it's going to be past that too. Thank you for being here. And I guess I'll see you in the future.